Bad Genie by Alice B. Claggett. Dear Ones, Here is my personal account of an encounter with a bad genie, an ifrit of the most evil demeanor any one can imagine. I ran across a bad genie, an ifrit, three decades or so ago in the Santa Monica Mountains of Southern California. In tenor of its beingness, it seemed to me to be quite similar to the ifrit that is the topic of the image before you. The bad genie I encountered those many years ago caused me a knee injury while I hiked towards its place of enchainment. It did this, I feel, purely out of spite at having been chained to that spot a long time prior. The good powers of the air had chained down this overlarge, spiteful being for causing the death of two lovers who had been parked in an automobile on that spot. It did so by creating in them a turmoil of deep despair, and a raging at this awful feeling, until they destroyed themselves rather than endure in that hellish thrall. Though none but I knew of it, the bodies of the two luckless lovers were buried in a rusted rumpled automobile in a pit in whose bottommost depths that odious Ifrit was chained. Some weeks after my encounter with the Ifrit, after my knee had healed, I brought a friend and his daughter on an arduous hike, on a trail frequented not by people but by deer and coyote, by rabbits and skunks and the like, to view the sight and let me know their psychic impressions. The daughter, who is quite intuitive, and a healer, noticed right away the tenor of the locale, and her father seconded her on that. I feel it must take a mage who is powerful beyond imagining to force such a being as that loathsome entity, filled as he was from the tip of his long curly toenails to the topmost strand of his dark spiky hair, to do his bidding. I feel no good might come of such an attempt, that is my thought about it. In love, light and joy. Alice B. Claggett. I am of the stars.